Southwest 1380 has an engine fire descending. Air traffic control got the emergency call about 1110 Eastern Time. Passenger Marty Martinez went on Facebook Live in his oxygen mask. Something is wrong with our plane, he wrote. It appears we are going down. He describes it as an explosion midair. And then probably within a matter of 10 seconds, the, the engine then hit a window and busted it wide open. Martinez posted these pictures of the damage as controllers try to figure out what happened. They said there was a hole in, and uh, someone went out. Um, I'm sorry, you said there was a hole and somebody went out? It felt like it was free falling and of course everyone's freaking out, everybody's crying. The plane was flying from New York's LaGuardia to Dallas Love Field when it made a U-turn and emergency landing in Philadelphia. Of 143 passengers and five crew members, only one passenger was taken to the hospital in critical condition, but despite some mid-air heroics, did not survive. It is our understanding, and again, it's still very early, it is our understanding that the, the passengers on board the aircraft, in addition to the flight crew and the cabin crew, did uh, some pretty amazing things under very difficult circumstances. Aviation expert Joe Sweeterman says 737s like this one are considered workhorses, and while engine failures occur, this was different. But actually, an engine coming apart like this with parts flying everywhere is, is really unusual, and it's going to, of course, lead an investigation about 737s in general. And the NTSB is on the scene tonight in Philadelphia. Southwest Airlines said in a statement that safety is a top priority, and right now they're working to support the passengers and crew members aboard that plane, many of whom thought they were going to die. A lot of people feeling very lucky tonight. Live in the control room, Roseanne Teas, CBS 2 News. Yeah, what a horrific morning it was. Thanks, Roseanne.